Hey Cantor, welcome to my channel and welcome to your September update. We're going to find out what's going on for the month of September for you. Please remember this may not read for every can, so let's get straight into this and find out what's going on. Oh, Two of Cups and the Lovers, okay. Definitely somebody feels a very strong soul connection to you, okay. I do see that this person is very inspired by you, okay? They really want to build with you, okay? I'm hearing love at first sight. This person felt an instant connection to you. You could be dealing with a Leo or a Gemini. I do see that you really bring somebody peace, okay? It's like when you speak to somebody, um, like when you speak to this person, you bring them peace, okay? Um, I do see this person not really moving forward, though. Yeah, like, this person, they're keeping their feelings to themselves, okay? But they do feel a very strong connection to you. Like, this person's in love with you, right? They're just failing to communicate that with you at the moment, okay? They're keeping their feelings to themselves. This person's very intimidated by you, Cancer, okay? They feel like you have a lot of options. Um, you're very creative as well, very spontaneous. Um, I do see you being somebody that seems to bring a lot of comfort to people, okay? Especially this person. But they feel like you have a lot of options. Um, and they feel like that they don't have a lot to offer, okay, compared to other people, right? So this person is like staying on the safe side, okay, and keeping them fe their feelings to themselves. I do see that this is literally a divine, a divine gift I'm hearing, okay, but this is a soul connection. This is something that is being handed by, um, handed to you by spirit, okay, but this person doesn't seem to be doing their part. They don't seem to be moving forward. I do see this person being very scared of rejection, okay? This person seems to be very anxious, okay? I'm hearing on edge, this person is very anxious to move forward. I do see them watching you, okay? But keeping a distance, right? This person um, is like depressing all their feelings and it's sort of turning into anger and frustration, right? This is this person literally ignoring this um new beginning okay spirit is coming forward and handing this person a brand new beginning like a gift and they are rejecting it okay because they seem to not be trusting their intuition okay this person seems to have like a very low self-esteem they feel like that you're way out of their league can't so they feel like you have so much to offer this person um doesn't really see their own worth, if that, if that makes sense, okay? And it's like they're staying on the safe side and not telling you how they feel, but at the same time, they're rejecting their own gift, their own blessing, right? I do see that you have a few options around you, but somebody, okay, has a... They could be a Virgo, I'm hearing, or a Capricorn. They have strong feelings here for you that they're keeping to themselves, okay, because they're scared of rejection. I do see other people, okay, trying to come at you in the month of September, especially another person. They do seem to be somebody that isn't held back, okay. They seem to be very charming. They go for what they want, okay. Yeah, so you're going to, like, somebody that's very spontaneous and coming into your life, okay, they're not scared, okay, um, they're not scared to tell you how they really feel when this other person that has a soul connection to you seems to be very scared. I do see this person letting fear take over, right? This person literally feels like that you would never go for them. This person seems to have no confidence, right? But there is somebody that's coming into your life that is overly confident and they're going to come at you. The thing is, there's no love there, 
okay, you don't feel a connection there. This person may be very attractive. I'm hearing green iron. I do see that you aren't interested in anybody else, right? Like your heart is with this person that can't really express their feelings, okay? And their heart is with you as well. This is a twin flame, guys, okay? With the king and queen of one here, okay? And the knight of cups in reverse in the middle. Um, this is literally something where you both feel the same about each other. But the thing is, nobody's really communicating, right? There's lack of communication. Um, I do see that this person expects the worst. They feel like that you're too good for them, that you're really beautiful, okay? I am getting that this person's attractive as well, but they just don't see it, right? This person really has a low self-esteem, again. They feel like it's better to look away, okay, but they're also very angry because they feel like they're missing this opportunity. I am getting that this person sort of feels weak when it comes to you, right? You make them feel very weak, very vulnerable. Again, this person is really... They're getting guided to you, okay? They have strong love here. Like, this person's in love, right? They feel a strong connection here to you, right? They keep getting guided to speak to you. They can't stop thinking about you. But they keep ignoring the advice. They don't trust their intuition, okay? This person feels like that you're going to reject them, right? They feel this connection as well, but they're scared that you're going to reject them. This person really wants you to reach out. Again, lack of communication, okay? This person seems to be very nervous as well. They're thinking the worst, all right? Like, like they feel like if they do reach out, you're just going to reject them, embarrass them. This person seems to be scared of embarrassment and rejection. This person just keeping themselves away from you yet watching you, okay, and they're very disappointed because they want to be with you, Cancer, but they seem to be keeping themselves away from this, okay, not expressing their emotions and nothing's moving forward. There may be people around you that are trying to move forward, but you don't seem to be interested either because the way that you see it is this person isn't moving forward or saying anything and you feel like they're not interested. I'm hearing 16, let me know if that resonates. I'm hearing Laura. I do see this person wanting to communicate and going to communicate, but this person feels like that this person has a very low self esteem. They feel like you may, they're scared you may ignore them, okay? This person, if they did communicate, they would really be in for a pleasant surprise because they're assuming that you're just going to disregard them, okay, ghost them. In, like, they're really embarrassed, okay? This person had a problem showing their true emotions, especially to you because they've put you on the pedestal here and they feel like they're probably going to embarrass themselves, right? Yeah, so this person decides to just literally hold back. The thing is, they see other people are interested in you and not scared to move forward. And they seem to be really jealous, okay, of these other people. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Leo. This person... This is stressing this person out. 
because they keep thinking about you, okay? They're, and the thing is, they keep hiding their feelings, which just makes them really angry. I do see this person basically starting fights with everyone exploding almost, okay? Because they're holding themselves back here, okay? And they're clearly unhappy. This person feels a very strong connection. This could be somebody from your past, but they feel a very strong connection to you, okay? Like a past life connection. I'm hearing Bella. I do see a fair few different people interested in you, okay? I do see that you really stand out. You have a very... It's like a very caring energy, okay? People seem to come to you for advice. You make people feel safe. Like, a lot of people seem to want happily ever after with you because you bring happiness. Like, being around you brings happiness. You also have, I am getting that you're really attractive. You have a lot of people that are intimidated, okay, by you. So they may hold back their feelings, but you make a lot of people happy. There's something about your energy. It's like very bright, okay. It's like you walk into the room and you change the whole room. Like you change the energy of the room, okay. You change the energy of people. It's like people can just talk to you and you make people feel peaceful, right? I do see that like a Capricorn or an Aries that's really into you, stuck on you, obsessed with you, okay? Also very possessive over you, okay? This sort of feels like somebody that sees other people trying to go near you and they get really angry, okay? This person like wants to fight people that talk to you. Okay, they feel like that they want to be with you, but they don't seem to have the courage to come forward. They're scared of rejection. They're scared that you're too good for them. I do see them want, they do want a new beginning. I mean, with the Ace of Cups, the Sun, and the Ten of Cups, like, that's all they want, okay? All they want is, you know, to start this. They, they're in love with you. They want this happily ever after with you, okay? You make them really happy. This person literally wants to marry you, I'm hearing. Yeah, but they don't have the courage here to come forward and let you know, okay? And this is making this person very unhappy, right? Stressed out like this person cannot sleep because spirit is haunting this person with signs about you, right? This person needs to come out and express their feelings, but they keep running from that. And the more they run, it's like the stronger the feelings get, the more intense signs get, the more intense the dreams get. This person really needs to let their guard down, okay? And spirit trying to communicate that with them because this person is coming off as very cold, okay? Like they don't care. The thing is, it's like they're giving you the wrong idea when the thing is they're just very nervous, okay? They're very shy. They're scared that you're too good for them. They're scared that you didn't know better, that you're going to reject them. This person's actually really scared that they're going to come forward, let you know how they feel and you're going to make fun of them and like... They're going to be embarrassed, if that makes sense, okay? So that's all I have for you, Cancer. If it resonated, let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.